Right, with Sean Pollock, then it's time to get into that uh, rapid fire section. Short questions, short answers, and, and a lot of fun, sir. First one for you, Sean. Best all rounder? Kellis. Why? You said one word. Right? <laughs> <laughs> I said one sentence. Okay. Um, okay, cut good. Uh, um, no, I think his, his ability to bat long periods and, and to contribute with the ball um, and the great hands, too. So, yeah, always mm. appreciated having him in our team. Most difficult batsman to bowl to? Oh, there's so many, but different yeah. times of their career. Mm -hmm. Tenduka, Lara, Ponting, um, Gilchrist, Hayden, anyone would stop. Do I have to stop at one? <laughs> there's so many. You've got um, a lot of them out there. Yeah, you do, but I'm saying when they're in their fine form, uh, you know, it's a hell of a hard effort to get them out. When they're in bad touch, you feel like you can knock them over any time. But uh, I think if I had to pick one, It's okay, we got no, the answer. Can't. <laughs> so, sometimes not being able to pick is an answer in itself. Exactly. So, if someone, if, if you're a little kid and, you know, someone gave you money to buy a lollipop, you could only buy one lollipop with it. Yeah. If someone gave you enough money to watch one player play, one past, player. present, now, any player in the history of the game. Um, sure. I would love Nepotism's to watch. allowed, you can. No, uh, if someone said to me you could get someone at their pump to watch them play and, and see what they're all about, I would definitely go for Bradman. I mean, so much has talked about Bradman. Mm -hmm. I never got to see him play. Maybe just those movies that move like Charlie Chaplin. So to be able to compare him to what I've seen, uh, I think would be Bradman. Not Graham Pollock? I saw a lot of Graham. Um, you did? Yeah, I mean, he still played for Transvaal growing up. Yeah, so. but in his pump, he would have been different. Well, yeah, I mean, there's, there's a lot of people in his pump. Um, yeah. But yeah, that would have been great. Um, I think you know, to play alongside him would have been great. You know, yeah. that would have been a little fantasy that uh, could have been the last he lived out. What does the line, come on, Polly, remind you of? Um, probably Andre Nell. <laughs> Don't ask me why, but as you said that, it came <laughs> to my mind. I think he was always at mid on and he would shout, come on, Polly. Um, yeah, okay. No, it would just be dig deep, come on, you can do it. Okay. Give us a, a little bit more effort. Best ledge coming for you, against you? Best ledge you were? Best ledge. Um, gosh, you hear the different stories. Um, best ledge. Now I know why you can't remember. If it was Andre Nail, he would no, remember I can, I, but I can remember. I can remember some long-winded ones, you know, that okay. would take forever to explain. Okay. That's all right. But um, you just gave me the best expression on camera you could ever have, so that's okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I'll move on. Wicket number four hundred. Do you remember who? Uh, Raul Dravid. There we go. Indian captain. Three hundred. There's also a captain, Michael Vaughan. Two hundred. Uh, Nimiel Zorz Zoiza. A uh, hundred. Was another captain at the time, Courtney Welsh. Only one who I've messed up was Zoiza. I don't know if we are. And of course, you remember one. One was Graham Thorpe. So the, so the comparisons with McGrath don't end there. You remember all your wickets? Not all of them, but those yeah. milestones, definitely. Best bouncer you bowled? Best bouncer I bowled was probably... Uh, well, I can remember one in a provincial game, which was fantastic, but uh, the best one in a test match would have probably been to Mark Atherton in my first test. But all South Africans love to bowl bouncers to him for some reason. No, but just to have hit him uh. on the head in the first game, you know, created a bit of a stir. Real life made people think I'd arrived. <laughs> Which was the World Cup South Africa should have won? 99. Mm, I thought so. If you met Duckworth... And, and 2002. And <laughs> <laughs> no joking. <laughs> if you were to meet Duckworth and Lewis, what would you tell them? I've got over Duckworth and Lewis. They're not on my Christmas list yet, mm -hmm. but I've forgiven them. Um, no, I think, you know, obviously they had to come up with a formula to try and do it. Um, he's actually one of them as a South African, so that's quite bizarre. But uh, we coined a phrase in our team, one run can make a difference. And uh, at two World Cups in a row, it did make a difference. So we've stopped coining that phrase. What is the new South Africa about? Um, I think it's amazing how we've integrated. Uh, I think we, we're diverse, and I think that's a strength of ours. Um, we're passionate about our, our country, about our sport. Uh, and we're passionate to make sure we get things right. So I think it's got a lot of good things if we could just sort out things like crap. Complete the sentence. If God gave me another chance. If God gave me another chance. <laughs> um, Someone's given me these to ask you because I'm enjoying <laughs> asking them. If God gave me another chance. 
No, I wouldn't want another chance. Okay. I'm happy. And, and I'll end with where we started. If someone said, here's, here's a check, write what you want on it, we look after your family, but just underperform in a cricket match, what did you tell them? It would be a waste, a real waste, because what's the point? You wouldn't be as dramatic as Budgie, who said, I'll slap him. No. No, I mean, there's, there's real reality is those things are part of the world, and uh, they do go on, but uh, no, okay. definitely not. Love your answer, Sean, but I must tell you the best answers were where you said nothing at all and the camera captured the look on your face. So thank, thank you very much for, for joining us, Sean. It was, it was great fun as usual. And if you remember what I said at the start of the program, one of the nice guys in the game, and I think that came through.